With this session update, I'm Shannon Lurkey. The Civil Law and Data Practices Committee grappled with the details of a bill that would prohibit social media companies from using algorithms that specifically target children. Here are some highlights. Algorithms are not seen. They're hard to understand. They're not tangible. But they are much as much of a danger to our children and even more insidious because they're not well understood. So this simply is an attempt to protect kids from things just as harmful as tobacco and alcohol and everything else. Nearly 20% of these young children are using social media daily. We've known for years that social media platforms, especially image-based platforms like Instagram, can have very harmful effects on teen mental health particularly for teens struggling with body image, anxiety, depression, and eating disorders. Understand that over the past year, there has been numerous stories written in national media that blame algorithms for choosing negative content to display to kids and teens. But if I leave you at one point, it's that algorithms are also the very same tools that help services target good content towards kids and teens. As a parent, I share that concern. I've got a 14-year-old who's on social media all the time. Um, and, uh, you know, we try to keep track of what she watches, but we can't do a great job of it unless we're just sitting over her shoulder all the time. I tend to lean toward uh, uh, advancing the cause of the First Amendment, even when I don't like what the First Amendment might allow to be spoken or communicated. Because we've heard what we heard tonight for a long time previous to this. Yes, we understand there are issues. Yes, we wanna to work together. Yes, we take protection very seriously. But those all sound like just words and platitudes when there's not the actions to back it up. And I don't know, short of passing this bill out, what can motivate you to actually take actions. What's right here is to stop this and to send them a message, as you said, Mr. Chair, Send them a message. The people in the state of Minnesota will protect their kids against this evil, invisible chunk that they put out. They do it to make money. Your kids are being harmed because they want to make money. To continue following these issues and more, watch legislative coverage Monday through Friday on the PBS Minnesota channel or visit our website, www.senate.mn/media.